specific rat number. My specific recommendation with these machines is to make the uh, sample name not too long, but long enough so you know exactly what part it is that you're looking at for a given customer because you want to be able to come back to it with that timestamp and say this is this is what we've run for you. Here you can see the numbers. They start generating after the, the 45 seconds. It tells you what type of substance you might be in because it could be looking for chrome and plastic or in steel, brass, or solder. This is the polyethylene matrix, which is where we run most of the uh, Rojas studies and a magnesium aluminum program as well. And all those would be named here. So if you were in PVC or PE and needed to be in the brass, you could, it would literally let you change it on the fly and start your analysis over. So here you can see these are the results after 60 seconds. Normally for a little better stability of peak structure, we would go 100 seconds, but for Demonstration sake, we go 60 seconds. And even then, you can see the numbers are very close. This cadmium is a 100 ppm standard. The bromine is 500 ppm. The mercury is 200 ppm. And the lead is 400 ppm. So you can see everything's staying within a, a 10 to 20 percent window.